I've decided that cleaning brushes is like the worst freaking chore ever. So my skin has been going crazy. I mean, hopefully you can't tell in this video, but I thought it was just hormonal. And it's been like this for, now it's been like this for a month. Because what happened was I thought it was hormonal and now it's like the next cycle. And all the problems I, I was having are still there. And it's kind of like continued on and it's like now it's the same problems from the previous cycle and the new one together and it's just like totally acting up and I don't know what's going on and now that like I realize it could be from that but like it could not be like I don't know maybe I'm doing something wrong or like maybe my skin's just like going through a transition like you get older your skin changes I don't really know so bottom line is I just made an appointment with the dermatologist and of course like they never have anything right away. And she's like, is it an emergency? I'm like, no, it's, you know, it's honestly not. It's just like vanity. <laughs> so the soonest they could take me was the 18th. So now I will be going to the dermatologist the 18th and hopefully I will find out what is going on with my skin and like what is wrong with me. And then while I'm there, I'm going to do that dreaded full body check. And like in high school, I worked at a tanning salon and I did it so much. And I'm honestly like, a total body check like always just panics me every time I have to get it I'm just shaking it it just freaks me out so I do wear SPF now though because now I'm like so like terrified so that's why I like all these vlogs I'm like never wearing makeup because I just have like treatment on my skin it's like really bad I've never had like acne prone skin I've never had problematic skin I mean back in college I used to sleep with my makeup on all the time and like never got breakouts I've never been so excited to go to a doctor like I need to find out what's going on it's driving me crazy so now I'm getting ready to leave I'm like making sure I have everything my keys are up front. <laughs> we are going to get our Christmas tree. Yay! Sorry, it's dark. Those are really pretty. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we just got back from the grocery store and our tree. So I'll show you the groceries. We have our little tree stand over there. So, and look, isn't this so cute? I don't know where I'm going to put it yet. It's like a little sleigh. So we got cooking spray for eggs. This is for Gatsby. He's actually at the puppy hospital right now getting tested for his allergies. Um, they just called us that he's up and ready to be picked up. Thank God he's okay. Um, I got some vanilla extract for some holiday baking. Um, my husband eats whole wheat pasta every night, so we got this. Some whipped cream. Egg beaters and egg whites. I eat eggs for like way too many meals <laughs> more eggs organic eggs um i didn't even know my husband picked this up guacamole i guess that's for this weekend <laughs> i got these because i'm obsessed with these kind of cookies the chocolate peppermint cookies it's like a brownie with a white chocolate peppermint coating they're so good i always get like mostly healthy and then like a little treat like the whipped cream that brush is drying um baby carrots i just eat these for a snack like every day <laughs> i love baby carrots Actually, I'll probably dip them in the guacamole. Um, baby arugula for lunches and dinners. For dinner this week, we're going to be having flank steak, which is a nice lean cut of steak and also tastes really good. And my husband is going to have these uh, uh, natural pork chops. I don't eat pork, so I'm not going to be having those. Um, for me, I got, because we do like red meat like twice a week, and then the rest of the week we'll have some kind of white meat. So I got these... 99% fat-free ground turkey breast, and I'm just gonna make myself turkey burgers like for lunch and dinner. And then we got a shit ton of asparagus to broil. We got so much because it shrinks down so much. And a couple different veggie burgers. And that's it for the week. Gatsby. Wait, oh, your little shape spot on the other side. What the guy? We got allergies to grass, the dust mites. And what was the other thing? on the sheet. I forgot. You feeling better? Look at like all, this is where they did all the shots. So they marked him up here and then each dot is where a shot was. Move your elbow. And he had all these dots are all the shots he had, but they did the shots like down here. I mean, he looks this looks okay. You can't even see the injections, but I guess like he just reacted how he reacts to normal allergies. So he has the little like 
redness on his eye. 